guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the LT40, getting the BMW uh, 3 liter, 6 cylinder turbo diesel. Alright, let's fire this baby up. Let's do it. Woo! Oh yeah, a lot of choo-choo noises. Yeah. Never saw one of these until working here and you have two of them. It really makes sense. You know, straight six, twin turbo diesel, you can't beat it. It fit in there surprisingly well. So lately we've been completing the install. We had missing the belts for the alternator and the belt for the power steering. And so here we have our uh, custom-made power steering bracket that comes in place of the compressor. Yeah. And we have made those uh, hydraulic lines that are super nice. Benjo, high pressure lines. We come around here. We can see the engine mounts. Passenger over there, the driver's side. Uh, we got a, a good clearance from the, the diff to the open. And everything is very happy right now. We're super, super excited. I, I'm excited to really ride in it yeah. and see what it does. Because this engine sounds mean. <laughs> it does. There, there's nothing but turbo noise. Yeah. So good. Like the throttle response? Yeah. It's like a race car. It's yeah. just a woof. <laughs> it's like a dirt bike. It's yeah. amazing. Oh, it's snappy for sure. Cooler. And the oil cooler. And the uh, oil filter. Oil filter is easy access, so you can just like put your hand from underneath and, and do it. And the air filter is tucked up there. Air filter is tucked here, ready to receive the snorkel. So, yeah, all together. First time uh, driving it, it's very exciting. Let's go for a spin. Inspection cover. What do we have? With the uh, dipstick right in nice. there. Nice. There we go. Sweet. <sighs> nice setup. Ooh. Tucked in there nicely. Yes. Nice. That is so beautiful. Factory air box was in that corner, and uh, since our air filter and everything is up front from the turbo system, uh, we went ahead and reused that area to house the wiring in the ECU. And uh, you know, in a BMW, that's about where it would be, so everything worked out perfect. Uh, we we're able to use the factory elbow for the mass airflow, tucks right up over the frame rail nicely. 
and I got plenty of room in the back and room up front using the factory coolant tank and the uh, factory front section of the hoses. Yeah, in the BMW they have a f uh, the windshield sits right about here. Ooh. You can only reach the front three cylinders. I see. Up front we got the OBD2 port mounted up under the dash with a uh, little wireless uh, reader that goes up to a phone or a tablet. What else do we got? What the TAC? Yeah, TAC, revs, uh, GPS speed, which is nice if you ever put different tires on it, and uh, engine load. Sweet. We also have a drive-by-wire throttle. Yes. Installed. It it looks like it's designed from factory. I mean, yeah. it's just exactly the same pedal, mm -hmm. like the long, yeah, uh, long and skinny, with like the the attachment at the bottom. Yeah, the swivel point at the bottom, and it's actually pretty comfortable. Yeah, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. Nice. I think that completes the the tour of the LT. When uh oh, let's fire that thing. Fire it up. Yeah. Okay. Do it. Woo! Yeah. That sounded nice. Imm immediate start. Yeah. And it's real smooth. Those six cylinders, I, I think it, I mean, it, it idles at like 700 RPM. Yeah. It's amazing. Oh yeah. A lot of choo choo noises. Yeah. This is a uh, 200 and 75 horsepower from factory. Yeah. And a single tune, without touching anything, bring it to 430 horsepower and 700 newton meter of force. Yeah. But in our case, we're gonna keep it 275 horse and possibly even in this vehicle, detune it to 240. So it's 40 miles. Still insane for the rest of the drivetrain, like the brakes, the transmission, the diff, but at 240, you can move some serious overlanding gear yeah. in comfort. Yeah, compared to the stock setup, with it almost double the power, that's, that's awesome. And I think if fuel efficiency also, this common rail yeah. has just so much uh, better fuel economy and one thing that we talked about before is availability before I would break down in the middle of, of nowhere I would have to call uh, what triple A yeah. and be like hey my LT has what is the LT my friend yeah. for now I'm like hey my BMW needs an alternator. They're like, oh sure, I'll bring you one. Yeah. Or something like this. So yeah, this is very much uh, more standardized and up to date. Yeah. Yep. I guess uh, let's give it a few more revs for the pleasure of my ears. And that's gonna wrap it up for today.